In this video, I'm going to show you a quick way to switch to full screen mode in Premiere. Three, two, one. Here we go! Hi and welcome or welcome back to DIY Film with Merle Becker, the channel where I help you make better videos. As always, stick around to the end of the video for a bonus tip. Okay, so here's a quick tip that's going to make your edit way better. Let's dive in. I'm in Premiere version 22.1.2, so if yours is older or newer, it might look slightly different. So here's what we're doing. When you're editing, you generally want to have your program tab open like so. And when you're playing down your timeline, you usually want this window to be as large as possible so that you can see more of the detail in your shots. In most cases, to make the program tab larger, you stretch it downward like so. But there's a quicker and better way to do this by setting a keyboard shortcut to quickly go to full screen mode when you're editing, like so. My keyboard shortcut is the letter E. So whenever I hit E, boom, full screen. And I hit E again to go back to regular view. So here's how you do it. First, open Premiere and go to the Premiere Pro menu and scroll down to keyboard shortcuts. Once in keyboard shortcuts, go to the search field, which is halfway down the panel and search for toggle full screen. And to the right of it, you'll see a bunch of characters. And I'm not gonna lie, I have never been able to make these work, and I'm not joking. So let's change them to the letter of your choice. By clicking on them, hitting the little X here to clear out the box, and entering the letter or number of your choice. I chose E because I have a bunch of shortcuts already in this area, and E is right next to the others. So type your letter or number of your choice in this field. If the letter you choose is already in use, you'll get the option to overwrite the existing shortcut or keep it. And once you've typed in your letter, hit OK in the lower right to save your choice. And that's it. Now, every time you play down your timeline to watch your piece, hit that letter and watch the piece in all of its full screen glory. All right, before we get to the tip, I just wanted to let those of you who are based in the US or Canada know that Adobe is offering 25% off of their Creative Cloud plans all this week. The offer ends May 30th. So if you've been looking to pull the trigger on Premiere, I'm just saying, I'll leave a link in the description. All right, let's do a quick tip. Adobe Premiere's got a keyboard shortcut for just about everything, and you should be using them. Because, according to Brainscape, those who use keyboard shortcuts when doing computer work save themselves two seconds for every minute of work. That means if you worked on your computer for eight hours a day, every day for a whole year, using keyboard shortcuts, you would finish your work eight days earlier than someone who wasn't. For real, just start using keyboard shortcuts so that you can take off the last week of December. All right, as always, if you found any of this to be helpful, please give the video a thumbs up, subscribe and hit the bell so you know when the next one is posted, and I will catch you next time.